We're back. At the Exeter Corn Maze. Man, we safe and mashed up once again. Yeah, we're about to get on a wagon, right? Mm -hmm. We're gonna go pick some pumpkins. And then we're gonna carve it. Yes, yes. and I'm gonna beat you That's too. That's the best man. Look, man. This, see, this ain't, this ain't, this ain't the, 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 the previous pumpkin <laughs> contest one. Come on. Yeah. Let's go ahead and talk about it in the wagon ride that we're gonna head out yeah, to. All right, let's go. I've actually never carved a pumpkin. Well, real talk. Um, actually, the best tool you can use is just a plastic butter knife. Nothing else. You'll be fine with okay. that. And I'm also not an art, I'm also not an artist, so like I know an artist. My girlfriend, she's actually really good at drawing, so I'm gonna have her stencil something onto it. Bunch of variety. There's a little one. I see the little, little teeny tiny ones, and there's hey, a little hey, right hey, behind hey. us. Yeah, if y'all need pumpkins, hey, check it out here. This is the place to be, man. It's a pumpkin. What about? You could live in this stuff. I was about to say, what about what about this one though? Because this one might. What about this one? Say yes to this one. Yeah. Found my perfect yeah. pumpkin. Keepa. <laughs> so, upon walking through the pumpkin patch, I spotted this big fella right here. Now, if I took this pumpkin home, for one, I don't even know if it could fit in my car. But for two, I don't know if I use this as a pumpkin to call or use it as a stoop to sit on when I'm playing the game. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with this, this big boy right here, you know what I'm saying? I'd be a little crazy, go with a white pumpkin? I mean, or do I go classic orange I mean, you pumpkin? Did say It's my pumpkin. I'm kind of dirty. Okay. Alright, so we all said yes to a pumpkin. Not Some of them better than others. <laughs> the best pumpkins in the patch. I think we did. Look, we got some good pumpkins and we had way too much fun on that wagon ride, man. Just chilling. What, what's your pumpkin name? This is Cindy. Cindy. Mm -hmm. This is a little Humphrey right here. And this is William. Mm -hmm. So what we gonna do right now, you know, we gotta get back home so we can get to carving these pumpkins. That's what a real fun come in now. I'm excited for it. Y'all excited? Yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I'm super excited. It's my first time carving, like I said, so. Grace, yeah. Man, y'all don't leave me like that. All right, guys, so I just got home from the Exeter Corn Maze. Um, before we left, our director decided to give us some carving tools. I'm gonna need it, because I don't know what I'm doing. And you can kind of see little Humphrey. You doing all right back there, buddy? You know, I'm gonna give you a quick shower before we get you carved. So I'm gonna head inside and give him a little wipe down. All right, guys, so I'm back in my apartment. I've given Humphrey a good old wipe down. I'm gonna give him a little face, just like his daddy. Good looking boy. But I'm gonna give him a more permanent face. Give him this Dracul picture right here. All right, guys. So we got the stencil in. Here's that bad boy right now. Look at him, looking like his daddy still. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm not kissing you. But um, yeah. So the stencil is impeccable. No, I didn't do the stencil because I'm not that talented. I had my beautiful and amazing talented girlfriend do it for me. Yeah, she's an artist. Spooky was my original design. I thought about doing, you know, but I decided nah, cause spooky is how run pumpkin gonna look when he get done. Oh, wait, wait, nah, I forgot he said his girlfriend can draw and she's gonna stencil something on for him. Boy, you grown, you can't do it yourself. Let's get into this bad boy. Let's pop this bad, this one, right? No, production crew saying no, that's fine. How about one of these? Yeah, making me feel like Michael Myers here. Mm. Ah, there we go, all right, so we're gonna go ahead and start carving this up and yeah. Oh, was that supposed to go that deep? Uh. Sure, yeah, that's right, that's right, yeah, yeah, that's right, yeah, yeah. 
All right, guys, so we're at the halfway point right now. Um, I had a little snafu here. Uh, that whole eye is kind of gone. That's fine, you know. I It's my first time carving. Stop judging me. I feel you, Jeremy and Morgan. Please. Enough. The competition's fierce. Things are really heating up. But you know what they say. Can't stand the heat. Stay out of the kitchen. <laughs> Get in there. Get out. Get, get, get out. All right, folks. So I'm on the home stretch right here. Uh, so as a first timer, you know, I, I, I did the best I could with what I had. Could I have picked an easier design? Totally. You know, it's just not fair. It's Humphrey and I's first time doing this. First time I'm ever carving a pumpkin. And all I get is just negativity. This from Morgan and, and, and bad tips from Jeremy. It's just, you know. It's not fair, you guys. I wasn't crying. I wasn't trying to, I wasn't crying. Humphrey, back me up here, bro. I wasn't crying, right? Here's my beautiful baby boy, Humphrey. But in any event, as I said, this is my very first time. Please vote for me. He's, he's got a couple of nicks and bumps there, but you know what? That's what makes him beautiful. Oh, hello there. It's Morgan and Cindy getting ready for the competition. Um, so Cindy here reminds me of Cinderella, hence her name, Cindy, and I've decided that I'm gonna break the mold a little bit and I'm gonna try to carve a castle. So <laughs> I'm not the most artistic. Um, also using a knife for said art is very scary, but we're gonna try it. So without further ado, let's get carving. Now listen, Cindy's a big girl. <laughs> this is gonna be very interesting. Oh, the reigning champ, Morgan. Y'all know she thinks she did something cause she won the last contest. But look, so I did the pumpkin patch. She picked out a white pumpkin. Cause you know, we got this thing we call it Cinderella. I get it. She's precious, Morgan, you're precious. But let me tell y'all, after she get done with this pumpkin, it's gonna be anything but precious. Okay. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> After a minor breakdown. Oh, I thought I had it. <laughs> Why can't I? <laughs> Don't tell Ron and Jeremy. Man, I got some really bad intel at that pumpkin patch. Uh, Morgan intimid trying to intimidate me with her connections that she said she has. Uh, that's how she won two years ago. Oops, I'm sorry, Morgan. I didn't mean to let leak that out. Okay, so I've been carving for quite a while now, but Ron and Jeremy are quaking. They should fear me. Oh no, I don't think I'm gonna win. I know that I am. Good old Cindy and I have been through a lot together. And I think we've really bonded. So if you think she's as beautiful as I do, please give us your vote. We would love to have it. Um, all the best to Ron and Jeremy, and I hope your pumpkins turned out half as beautiful as Cindy did. All right, y'all. So your boy is about to be carving Fatty Jack, but see, my pumpkin name is William, so I'm going to nickname him Lil' William. You know what I'm saying? So your boy is about to be carving Lil' William the pumpkin bat. So we about to get to it, man. We about to get cracking. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. We making the first indent in Lil' Willie right here, man. Boy, I ain't carved a pumpkin since the last pumpkin carving contest. But you know what I'm saying? It ain't like I got no competition, no way. Yeah, Morgan, Ron, the shots have been fired. Bang, bang. Whew. Sorry, um, I was just thinking about how interesting Ron and Jeremy's pumpkins are. All right, y'all, so right now, we at the midway point, you know, close enough, you know what I'm saying? So it's getting real in here. As you can see, I'm down on the knee, you know what I'm saying? Getting on up in there. 
But you know, I'm still waiting uh, to hear from my competition. Oh wait, like I said earlier, there is none. You know, I keep forgetting. So yeah, it's my very first time carving. You know, I've never pumpkin carved and I kind of got the hint that they were trying to give me bad intel, Jeremy. That's fine, it's no big deal. Look, if, if you have to do some underhanded dirty tricks like that to try to win, what kind of artist are you? So I saved the last part, you know, the best for last. I'm carving out the eyes, you know what I'm saying? Carving out Lil Williams' eyes. Why do I say this is the best part? Because, you know, I'm carving out the eyes because I can't see my competition. They just don't exist. <laughs> All right, okay, okay, okay. All right, so we're gonna finish these eyes up. Then I'm gonna show y'all the finished product and it's gonna be booming. So y'all stay tuned for me. Man, I wonder how my competition is doing. Ah, what the heck, no I don't. I know how they doing. Terrible, losers do what losers do. All right, y'all, so this is my victorious finished product, you know what I'm saying? So y'all saw when I was carving, you know, I was doing a little stencil, but I started to freestyle, so you know what I'm saying? My man, you know, Big Willie, he ate some pumpkin that didn't agree with his pumpkin, and he started vomiting, you know what I'm saying? So I carved him these buck teeth right here, carved him some eyes up here, and this became a mouth somehow, and you know, I just put the little pumpkin meat in there, and he, he throwing it all up. So Morgan, run, be scared. Because if I was y'all, I would. Who would win? It's up to you now. Be sure to head on over to the ARCWCrew.com to vote. Thank y'all for watching.